What's up? We here at Real Talk with Stephen and Cam at the Falcons. First look, we're here with Falcons great Harry Douglas. Man, how do you think practice went today? I think it went good. I think the guys came out here and executed. Um, they went hard. And all you can ask is have a great attitude, come out here and work hard, uh, go through your assignments and get better. That's what you want to do every day while you're out here. So being a coach in the NFL, how do you like make – Make your mark in the NFL as a coach, like training people up, especially rookies this season. Well, I'll be honest, like first for me is understanding that I'm fresh to it and I'm new to it, but there's so many guys that's coaching ahead of me that has a lot of experience. Exactly. So being able to learn from them and learning how they do things and learning their teachings. But at the same time, being able to use the experience of playing the league for 10 years to help young guys out and even vets when they, when they look things here and there, right? You know, you don't want to try to – Overcoach things because you want guys to be natural and be able to play without being like a robot. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, if you see little things here and there, help them out along the way. Most definitely. And obviously, outside the stadium, you know, people feel like the odds are stacked up against the Falcons this season. What do you feel like the mood is with the coaching staff in the locker room to get the players ready for the upcoming season? I, th I think it's great. Uh, everyone is bought in, man. The culture here, uh, starting with Arthur Smith. Well, it starts with Arthur Blank, then it goes down to Rich McKay. Uh, Terry Pond of the GM and then the head coach Arthur Smith. Uh, you, they want to be a tough football team, but smart at the same time. And I think that's that's what they're building here. Yes, sir. All right, I appreciate you. Not Thank no you problem. so much. Thank you.